Oh, he bougie. Moose, that is a beautiful custom croc heel that you have there. Croc loving hearts are breaking everywhere. Hey guys, what's up? It's Lauren. Welcome back to uh, my channel. I'm gonna be honest. I've talked a lot of shit about Crocs. Like, a lot of shit about Crocs. I've also lightly bullied friends who have tried to pressure me into getting Crocs. And overall, I've really embraced the idea of boycotting them very heavily. And um, here we are. A whole ass video dedicated to Crocs. In the most anti-sponsored way. Like, I probably am on the Crocs blacklist after this video. Uh, uh, so, hi Crocs. You may have seen that Balenciaga just dropped in collaboration with Crocs a Balenciaga Crocs stiletto heel. And like this level of free, I just, I cannot wrap my head around it to the point where I'm waiting for one side of this collaboration to be like, oh, just kidding, like we trolled you because like this cannot be real. As a member of the 2021 society, I reject this idea. So in celebration of said free, we're gonna make some croc heels today. So let's go get some crocs. We are officially en route to securing the croc. I uh, actually bought a pair of crocs a few weeks ago, if you recall from the buying Amazon things that friends make me buy video. That is definitely not the title and I totally butchered it. My good friend Ollie forced me to buy some pink crocs uh, inspired by the queen Nicki Minaj. And now that I have crocs in my life, I still have very mixed reviews. Here are my thoughts. One, they're really expensive for like a piece of foam. Like a slab of foam should not cost $50. Two, with socks, honestly, pretty comfy and like convenient. The whole slip-on situation, very convenient. Without socks, don't understand in the slightest why y'all want little pokey ball thingies up in your feet. Am I missing something? I really don't know. So anyways, with all of that said, let's go spend some more money on Crocs. Oh my god, it's been so long since I've been to the mall and gotten like the shopping bag lines on my arm. Okay, so there's definitely a few things in here that are for me. Look away, packs on. I straight up waited in a line outside of Crocs. Like the growth of my Crocs attitude has just shifted so dramatically. So we've got hot pink and I fit into kid sizes for Crocs. So this I think is a size two and then this one is a size three, but that was so wildly successful. Also, I haven't been to a mall in months. I cannot believe I didn't break down and have like a massive panic attack. Okay, success. We've got two contenders here um, that are both going to be different styles because I, again, I really do not know how successful or unsuccessful this is going to be. We've got pink, we've got white, and I've got uh, these Jessica Simpson like chunky heel. And then this is gonna be the one. If we can pull this off, these are actual stilettos that I had in my closet but like never ended up wearing. So. They're being recycled as uh, upcycled. It's an upgrade, obviously. They're being upcycled into a croc stiletto. So here's the game plan. Remove these like top straps, remove the little studs on the side and cut this down. So I really only use this like top portion here. And then I have upholstery nails to potentially like reattach a top to it. <laughs> I'm gonna try and deconstruct this with as little damage as possible to the shoe. Not that I really plan on wearing these out to my next big event or anything, but like we're trying to shine, you know? We're trying to make a, a good ass croc heel and make Balenciaga proud. Oh shit, Jessica Simpson makes a sturdy heel. Oh, it's happening. It's happening. I've never really gotten a DIY injury while filming and I just feel like the irony of getting an injury while doing a croc video after how much shit I've talked about crocs is probably a big slap in the face from our good friend Karma. Let's go. <laughs> I'm so sorry if this hurts a croc lover's soul. Sorry, I'm not that sorry. I think we just need like this little section here. This feels like danger. <laughs> Well, because I can't keep the sole, so it has to detach here. 
Oh my god, it's happening. It's happening. The croc lovers are crying. The croc guys. lovers, I know, are crying. Ew, I literally hate the inside of that. <laughs> uh-oh, uh-oh. Pearl down, pearl down. I've disrupted everything over here. <laughs> There's no going back from here, I guess. Y'all, <laughs> this is gonna work. Okay, so I've got the two tops here. This portion right here is a little bit too short, so I have some white foam that I'm just gonna add on like the very top of it to lengthen that piece. I need a little more, I need a little more for the foot. So that was not the best glue job that I've ever done in my DIY career as I feel half the glue off my hands. This is good though. This gives us more to work with. Oh, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, we're making crack heels. We're making crack heels. <laughs> oh my God, this is gonna work. This is gonna work. That's really not the ugliest shoe that I've ever seen in my entire life. Like I've definitely seen worse. <laughs> what is this video? Oh, shit, I totally missed it. God damn it. Okay, round two. Oh my god, it's in. It's in. It's happening. Oh, that was a good one. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> That's a croc shoe. That is a croc shoe. Oh my god, oh my god. It really is not the worst thing that I've ever seen, to be honest. My craftsmanship, I'd give it a B minus, but it's it's a pass for sure. These are croc heels, like these are dead ass croc heels, no doubt about it. Like tell me you would not feel like the baddest bitch at your kid's soccer practice wearing these heels. Okay, so this is the real challenge here. I may have myself over a little bit because I thought that having a smaller size versus a bigger size would be more successful, but now in hindsight, after creating the beautiful masterpiece that are the chunky heels, I've sized down. So I'm a size three in Crocs. <laughs> And these are a size two. And so I'm not entirely sure how this is gonna go, but I think the game plan is gonna be to just like fully insert this in here and figure out how to size the soles of these together. You know what? I feel like we should even incorporate the strap. That's some energy that I wanna channel into these stilettos. Oh God. Oh God, I feel like I need like garden shears for this. Danger, danger, super danger. Oh shit, here we go, here we go, here we go. Success, success. Ah, croc loving hearts are breaking everywhere. Ah, woo, okay. <laughs> She's thick. Oh my God. That shit is thick. I think the top has to go. I really think it has to go. As much as I wanted to keep it, if we're gonna do a croc stiletto, I think we need to come in. Okay, let's just get an idea here. Oh, oh, bitch. <laughs> this is it. This is the move. This is for sure the move. Okay, so we got some work to do, but... <laughs> bottom is so thick. I think we need to literally like chisel down some of this because it is so, so thick. Okay, hang on. I need to use my brain at like full capacity for a second. We're back. <laughs> I'm not kidding. The utility knife is so sharp, but it's just not deep enough. So we've got options from the kitchen and they're working surprisingly well. I need like my entire body weight to do it. This is definitely like a, you need adult supervision. If you happen to recreate these, please don't. Oh my God, I'm legitimately sweating. I think that's as good as it's gonna get. I mean, uh, does it get better than that? Let's be honest. Also, I discovered the most wonderful thing. The Crocs band fits 
perfectly over this little front piece here so we can we can squeeze the logo in and it's gonna be great I'm gonna secure these in with some really professional hot glue it's gonna be great we'll do a little fashion runway walk afterwards Shoe. That's a legitimate shoe. <laughs> That's a croc stiletto. Oh my god. A thousand dollar Valencia price tag. Honestly. <laughs> Dead. Mission accomplished. Cue the f fashion show. Oh, he bougie. Oh yeah, Moose, walk with her. Moose, that is a beautiful, custom croc heel that you have there. Woof. So trendy, so on the pulse of fashion. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, the sun is so bright, I cannot see you. Am I just doing the outro with my eyes closed? Oh my God, this was so wildly successful. I know that there are a handful of videos where I tend to surprise all of us when the DIY actually turns out, but oh my God, Balenciaga moved the f over. I'm not gonna lie, like being genuine, dead ass honest, I kind of think that my pig stilettos might even be cuter than the Balenciagas. Just saying. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if there's anything like weird and designer that you'd like to see DIY'd. I think that's the first and last croc video we'll ever make, so I hope you enjoyed it. And I will see you on Tuesday for a new podcast over on the vlog channel and next Sunday for another DIY. Bye guys.